set to go and they are off they're racing but nobody wants to uh, make the running here Arantes has uh, consented to go on Arantes leads up by a couple of lengths early doors to road to gold who races in second position couple of lengths back in third place races another bill and then a gap of maybe two or three more to Cornbro who's sitting in fourth position early doors down towards flight number one they come and Arantz is the first to rise and land pops over by three to four lengths to road to gold in the gold jacket with a pale blue sleeves horse and a noseband racing second another bill is third in the red with the black and white striped sleeves as they arrive at flight number two Jumping back in fourth position is Cornbro in black and pink hoops. And then another hoop jacket, Imperial Prince, back in fifth position. That's followed by Bertilus in the checks with the red sleeves. And then towards the far side, Smuggler's Stash is next as they arrive at flight number three. This will be the last in a circuit's time. Behind Smuggler's Stash is Seven Devils to Mr. Don. Also racing just a little bit worse in center field is Parlor of Dreams. That's followed through by Here Comes Nelson with Rioca Day well back. Alexander is also well back in the field. South Sea Island is racing second last. Last and Norfolk Sound, the back marker, is fully 15 to 20 off the leader, which is Arantes and uh, Callum Beauty as they go past us on the first occasion. So Arantes shows away in the yellow jacket with the grey sleeves and cap, leading up by about three lengths to sitting in second position. Uh, road to gold as they take the turn towards the far side. Another bill is close up third. Cormorra still races in fourth position and a gap of maybe three to four lengths to Imperial Prince who's next in the field. They're followed through by Bertilus towards the outside of runners and then sticking towards the inner is Smuggler's Stash as they turn into the back stretch. Parlor of Dreams is behind that one racing center field as they take that turn. They're approaching flight number four and that's followed through by Seven Devils and Mr. Don and behind Mr. Don is here comes Nelson. Alexander is still well back in the field. So too Rioca Day from South Sea Island. And Norfolk Sound still at the back and still 20 lengths off the leader, which is Arantis as they take the first down the far side of the course. This is flight number four and they're all streaming over that fine although Norfolk Sound was a little bit slow towards the rear of the field. Off they go to the centre flight in the back stretch. This is flight number five. Arantes continues to show the way, but another bill put in a fine leap towards the outside there and landed in front. Back in third position, Road to Gold is still uh, travelling on the bridle, followed through by Cornbra. And then behind that one... Uh Parlor of Dreams has made some ground up in the grey and red diamond jacket. Then Imperial Prince towards the inside. Bertilus is next with red sleeves and cap. South Sea Islands trying to make some ground up from the back in the white jacket with the blue stripe. Between those horses is Seven Devils in blue and yellow. And then tucked in behind that group, Smuggler's Stash towards the inside of Mr. Don. Pace quickening as they reach the end of the back stretch, and it's another Bill who shows the way by about a half length to Arantes racing second. Right behind them, Road to Girl still travels okay. Towards that one's outside is Cornbra, followed through by Parlor of Dreams. Seven Devils next in the field. Then Bertilus towards the outside of South Sea Island as they take the turn. They're struggling a little bit behind. Imperial Prince heads the remainder back home, followed by Alexander. Down the straight they come towards the third last. Another Bill and Brian Harding into it by a length and a half. Arantis jumped it well in second position. Road to go, still travelling well on the far side with a black cap. Cornbra's coming near side in the black and pink. Bertilus is trying to pick up behind them as well from Parlor of Dreams and Seven Devils and South Sea Island and Seven Devils went at the second last flight of hurdles. They're racing down towards the final flight. It's another bill in front but Cornbra's a big danger near side. South Sea Island's trying to stay on behind them as well. Mistake by Road to Gold. They're inside the final furlong now and Cornbra's gone on towards the near side. Another bill's in bother towards the far side. He's trying to battle back but Cornbra's finding plenty in front. Racing inside the final half furlong. Cornbra driven out by Jake Green is going to land the spoils here. Cornbra's won it to another bill in second. South Sea Island was third, then road to gold and Bertilus. First number five, Cornbra. Second number two, third number 14, and fourth number 11. The full result of the first race this afternoon, the fast sprint maiden hurdle race. First number five, Cornbra. Second number two, another Bill. Third number 14, South Sea Island. And the fourth horse, number 11, Road to Gold.
position. Road to Gold still travelling well on the far side with a black cap. Cornbras coming near side in the black and pink. Bertolus is trying to pick up behind them as well from Parlour of Dreams and Seven Devils and South Sea Island. And Seven Devils went at the second last flight of hurdles. They're racing down towards the final flight. It's another bill in front, but Cornbras a big danger near side. South Sea Islands trying to stay on behind them as well. Mistake by Road to Gold. They're inside the final furlong now, and Cornbras gone on towards the near side. Another bill's in bother towards the far side. He's trying to battle back, but Cornbras finding plenty in front. Racing inside the final half furlong. Cornbra driven out by Jake Greenall. He's going to land the spoils here. Cornbras won it to another bill in second. South Sea Island was third, then Road to Gold and Bertolus.